there, uh, my name is Carson. I am a 19 year old attending Oberlin College and what I want to do in the month of January for my winter term project here is uh, record a full 10 song album. So I've had a lot of experience when it comes to recording songs. Um, I've been in professional studios, I've been in home studios, and I've known, I know now that uh, being in a home studio is where I, I'm most comfortable and most efficient when it comes to recording. So in terms of mapping out the entire project, the whole month of January is spent recording um, recording the songs. All, t all the songs are ready and composed. Um, they just need to be recorded. After that, we'll move on to the mixing phase, production, etc. Um, where my friends, I have um, a few people that I, um, friends at Oberlin who are willing to mix the songs for me. And we have some good deadlines with that. And then it moves on to the mastering phase. Now, take a listen to one of my songs, No Way. I recorded with using a USB microphone. Um, this is before mastering. I walk through the crimson door, expecting a whole lot more. And I gotta say, I lost my footing. And so I, I spent $10 on this one website that'll master your songs. It was just a computer program. Um, $10. Um, take, a, take a look. I walk through the crimson door, expecting a whole lot more. And I gotta say, I lost my footing. So, really, what that did is that gave that that little extra that little extra spice to that song, that extra flavor to it, and that's what ten dollars did. Now, imagine having you know someone act like a real person doing some sort of um, mastering with that. So, I'm looking to do that with all the songs here. Um, so, in terms of budgeting the project, I've budgeted everything. I've looked at the equipment I need to uh, make this project uh, possible. Sixteen hundred dollars for recording, six hundred dollars for mixing, and for additional tracks like drum loops. Uh, talking to other people about what, what else I could put in the tracks, um, more, sample, more samples, uh, $400 for mastering uh, for 10 songs, probably about $40 each worth of mastering, uh, and then $400 for distribution and publicity, so that comes to about $3,000 total. So one question that comes up is, what happens if you don't reach the funding goal? Well, I, I'm still doing the project, you know, I just have to use a lot, a lot more resources that I have at my disposal, um, I won't be able to distribute the album on as many platforms, I'll, I won't be able to give out as many physical copies. It will be, I'll be very limited in terms of resources, which is kind of difficult. But with this, I can have, I have so many resources at my disposal. I can, I will never have to step into a professional studio. I won't ever need this much money again to record future albums. So this really sets me up for this album and then everything that comes after that. I'm really excited to pursue this project. Um, anything helps at this point. The project is still going to continue on. No matter what happens, um, feel free to send me any questions, comments, concerns about the project. Um, my email is included on the Kickstarter page. Um, thank you so much. You know you might belong, belong with me.